What's up guys and welcome back to our channel. Today we are super excited to announce that we are moving on to phase two of our fitness journey. And that means we are going to be combining losing a whole bunch of fat with putting on that also desirable muscle mass. Let's recap phase one of our journey. Now we started about, I think it's 13 weeks ago now. It's a long time ago. And yeah, it was. And well, maybe not that long in the grand scheme of things. Mm -hmm. Anyways, <laughs> I started at 208.4 pounds, which is pretty crazy. And I was 109 centimeters around my waist. 13 weeks later I am at 170 pounds and 91.5 centimeters around my waist. That's a total loss of 38.4 pounds of fat that is completely gone which I'm very happy to be rid of and about 17.5 centimeters of diameter just shrunk around the largest portion of my, my midsection. But you might have noticed that actually from the past week or two I've actually put on a few pounds, almost three pounds actually, but we'll talk a little bit about that in a minute. Let's move on to how you've done this past um, 13 weeks. So I started at 109.4 pounds and this week I'm down to 99.8 pounds. It's crazy. Yeah. That's like, what's just about 10 pounds or so or something yeah, like that? something we'll like that. We'll put, put it, it up, up somewhere. Yeah, and then um, my waist was 28 inches and I'm down to about 25. So, 25. so, so it's three, three inches, inches, which is like six points. Seven point? I don't know. No, a lot of centimeters. centimeters yeah. Anyways, that yeah. is awesome. So we, did, so, we did good. Yeah, I mean, comparatively too, I think you probably lost more than me compared to like oh, percentage wise, wise or something like yeah, that. I don't well, maybe we'll just calculate that. Oh, we'll that'll, we'll yeah. put it up. We'll, we'll see percentage wise. Um, but yes. either way, I'm pretty pretty happy with where we are. Yeah. And we're ready to move on to phase two, which yeah. is super exciting. While I'm not on my goal right now, I want to be at 145 pounds. So I still have 25 pounds to go. But that doesn't mean that we can't move on to this phase two where, like I said, it's all about fat loss and muscle gain. And for those of you that think that you can't lose fat at the same time that you're putting on muscle, well, think again, because I actually did it um, two years ago when I was doing my 365 days of fitness and I was actually getting accurate body weight measurements from yeah. the hydrostatic uh, weight tank. Weight tank yeah. So I was getting accurate body fat measurements and I was gaining muscle at the same time of losing fat. So it can be done and we'll do it again. The goal obviously is really simple. Like I said, I gotta lose 25 pounds. So I'm gonna do that by continuing on doing intermittent fasting mm -hmm. along with just regular fasting. And for my muscle gain, I'm gonna be focusing on calisthenics training. And for those of you that don't know, calisthenics is just simply body weight training. And there's a whole lot of different exercises you can do just you know out of the comfort of your own home. No gym memberships, nothing mm -hmm. fancy, no programs or no trainers you have to buy, mm -hmm. just straight up hard work right here at home. And so for me, I'm really interested in calisthenics, but what about you? What do you plan to do for, for building muscle? Well, I already lift weights. Yep. Um, so, but I kind of like re, it's kind of been the same for like the last three months. Yep. So now it's time for like a switch up. So I'm kind of switching up my splits, which like what yep. muscles I hit each time I work out. Yep. Um, and that's about it. And yep. then incorporating more like high intensity interval training because yep. I haven't really been doing a lot of that. And that's really good for like fat yep. loss. Not that I need to lose any more that but sure, just for, for recomposition toning up or what have you. yeah exactly yeah, yeah. so, so yeah. safe to say that you're still pretty interested in lifting weights oh, that's yeah, kind of like 100%. your main focus on yeah. how yeah so yeah. i mean obviously we both have kind of different aspects of how we like to do weight training mm -hmm. um but it's fine like, whatever you want to do like weights or calisthenics you, or whatever do well, what works for yeah, you and do what you like right you gotta it. enjoy it yeah um but that's not to say that we're not going to be supporting each other in everything yeah. that we do because like we said earlier, I mean, having that support system is super, super, super important. Right. And um, yeah. if there's days that I'm gonna, I'm sure I'm gonna go down to the gym. Uh, we have a gym right down here in our in our building. I'll go down and do some weights with you, and maybe yeah. sometimes we'll have some do some pull ups with me. You know, whatever, yeah. right? Just keep things different and different. Uh, keep yeah. supporting each other and uh, putting yeah. on that uh, oh, serious muscle. Why does that hurt so much? It's not supposed to hurt. And that's it for phase two. Once I hit down to that goal of 145, we'll probably move on to phase three, but Let's not worry about that right now. Mm -hmm. Let's focus on this phase two of losing fat and building some muscle, mm -hmm. and uh, we'll go from there. So like I said, we're super pumped. Hope you guys are ready for this exciting part of our journey. If you're interested in any part of the routines that we're doing, probably post our routines up at some point in the next week or two mm -hmm. on our website at nutup.ca. So be sure to check that out yeah. uh, if you're interested in what we're doing. And of course, we also have our weekly podcast called The Nut Up Show. Yeah. And um, again, check out links on our website or probably in the description down below. Um, always happy to have you guys there. And, oh, you know what we, we didn't do? We didn't do what our stats were for this week. Okay. So let's just do that real quick. Yeah, because like I said, I gained a few pounds. So mm -hmm. I'm at to 170 this week and I gained 2.8 pounds um, since last week, which is pretty bad. And I also gained 
0.9 centimeters across my waist. Oh, yeah. Now, it's weird, but it's not weird because this week my sleeping pattern had, which was completely yes. shot. Like we launched a new website and I think there was a couple nights, well there's one night for sure I was up till 4 a.m. and just thrown off my oh. sleeping and then the, the night after I didn't get to bed till really late and wake up early as well too. Yeah. So I didn't get to exercise at all and I, I don't think I overate. Maybe I did overeat a little bit because I want to make sure I'm still ingesting enough calories. But I think I did too much on the carbohydrates because even yesterday our power went out and yeah. it was just sandwiches and peanut butter and jam sandwiches. Yeah. So not particularly very healthy stuff. Um, so well, and you have to get rid of that ice cream. It was a, yeah, and there was it's ice cream. Just Hurricane Dorian. So yeah, so you yeah. can't let the ice cream go. Can't let it go to waste. Um, but anyways, you know. Human, I guess, obviously. Yeah. Um, well, I think every, well, <laughs> everybody has weeks like that, I think. You know, yeah, like, it was a bad week. You go back down, and so you just like turn into a comeback. Not going to let it deter me. going to exactly. use it as motivation to get back on that get horse because it's frustrating. So I'm like, uh, I'm like even higher than I was two weeks ago. So now I have to do another two weeks just to get back down. So it's like it's this motivation to just keep moving forward, you know, not letting it spiral out of control. Out of control, yeah. Like last time. <laughs> It's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. Right? Yep. Right. All right. You. Me. Your turn. Uh, what did you do? So last week I think I was at 100.4. Yep. And then this week I'm at 99.8. Still so losing. Still losing. 0.6. Yeah, so. It's crazy. It's crazy. Um, and How much waste? And waste is just about the same. same. Yeah. 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 Yeah, it doesn't really change too much. Yeah, I feel like for you it's like you have that. I don't know what they say, you know, the stubborn, like it's just so little. Like you yeah, can yeah. just pinch, there's just, just like, like a little, little bit. bit there. <laughs> yeah, so it's not too much. So. so, but I think like really getting into like a good like weight. Lifting, yeah, this toning up is gonna yeah, be good. Yeah, it's gonna too. be good for yeah. you. Yeah, for and, sure. And um, with more muscle comes an increase in metabolism as well too, which should help. Eat more. Eat more. <laughs> more eat. cupcakes. No, no, no. Eat more fat, not cupcakes. Mm. Doesn't work that way. Mm. All right, let's nice. go to work. Let's do it. Thank you so much for watching, <laughs> and we'll see you right back here on Wednesday. Take it easy. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Fit it up. Hop in my car and I get it up. Get it up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Fit it up. Hop in my car and I get it up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Pick it up. Ooh, I've been on the flex since flex on. Neighborhood all in your eardrums. I ain't never scared like bone.